Ma. Ah. Oh, there it goes. I guess finally decided. A nice broadside shot, though. Rascal. Smoke would be rolling, but are the arrows? Oh, I can see there's more than one now. Can you guys see them? I didn't notice before. There's three, I guess. Oh yeah, nice. I hadn't even seen them all. Ah. <clears throat> they just can't tell what I am. No, I figures they'd keep eating. Yeah, I'm just another deer here. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Meow. Meow. did it. Off it goes. Oh, the other one. Oh, finally going to. <laughs> Guess the meow did it. Alrighty. Be digging for my... Oh, shoot. Hang on. I got you so dang close to me. Oh, there's the tower. Good old Escutney Mountain. Yes, sir. Alrighty. Be digging for my... Scared up the deer. I can still see them. They're walking up there. They're not very afraid. Uh, but I got to keep doing what I was doing. Searching the birches up here for some chugga. Fatwood or punkwood. I'll take out any of the three. So I'll bring you back if I find one of the three. I should be able to find something. And there goes the deer. They're running. I started moving. So can't stand there all day and have a showdown with the deer. Alrighty. We'll be back. See you soon. We're back. I did find some punk wood. It's pine. I don't know yet if it matters a lot, but it's some good spongy stuff. It's a little damp, so we'll probably bring it home and dry it, but I'm gonna collect some of this up. Do ya? Oh, oh yes. That looks really nice, and some of it's pretty dry, so hopefully I can make a hobo stove and char some of this up, too, for later. There's a lot here, so it can come back plenty of times. Oh, gosh, yeah, this is punky. Okay. Batty good. The old pine tree. And there's a lot of ones that look like they've died like this one probably died standing so I'm just gonna check some of them crotches and notches on the underside for some potwood which is very flammable wood where all the pine collects in the joints of the trees and can go into the roots sometime as well you can look at this there's another great punkwood tree and it's standing oh gosh yeah it's, oh, it's damp right there because it probably collected some of the water in the bark and stuff but I'm definitely going to check the crotch of this because it's dead all the way up here. Alrighty. We'll get back to you again. I definitely found my punk wood I'm looking for. So, some fat wood and to top it off, it'll be the trifecta chaga. Those are the three things I was looking for. And then we'll go back to the house and throw together a quick hobo stove and maybe try something. It's a lot to do for just today, but we'll give it a try. Alright, we'll be back. See ya. Be digging for my like and subscribe if you want to. See ya. Alrighty, I'll get you guys down here where you can see good. Right here will be our spot. Should be able to set this on that snow, which is very wet by the way, and it should burn for a short time. There it is. You can maybe see it shining if I hold it in just the right light has a definite odor to it too. You know definitely that you found it. And I know I don't usually ever use a lighter, but I am just for this because I got to get going. I haven't even got fire yet and I'm trying to find some uh, chaga too. So 
You know how it is. Oops. Anyway. Where is it? Here it sizzle. Oh, she went out. Just sitting on the snow, but that's burning nice. It's a good way to start a get a fire going if you have a spark or match it. And it usually works with a spark too, I'm pretty sure. But notice that smoke coming off there. It's another way to tell you found some good fatwood. Just a dead pine tree that died standing. And uh, it's settled into the branches. It doesn't have to die standing, I guess. I didn't time it. I like the other end. But you know, it lasted long enough to get some more pieces on if you had to. Oops, I put it out. <laughs> and I just got this too, so it's, it's fresh, wet. And it still burns. Well, if the wind doesn't blow out my lighter, then it burns really good. Oops. Sorry. So that's fatwood. Those are just a couple, just little pieces of pine I got out of this here branch. You can see it shining in the sunshine there, I'm pretty sure. It's still going, just sitting on the snow like that. Of course, you could probably manipulate them a little bit to get the flame going the other way, or just put them out too, like I just did. But they light right back up pretty easy. Alrighty. That's nice having a good day. So I gotta go find some gosh darn uh, chaga with any luck. All the birch trees up here I've seen so far look pretty healthy so I don't know if that has anything to do with it. I'll get back to you. I gotta go. Uh, it's still still going. It's wild huh? It's fatwood. Good thing to find is yeah, most any dyed pine tree versions. White pines Work pretty good for me, I think, because we have mostly white pines around here, but uh, a red pine is a better... Coming up on some big old, old looking birches, so I <clears> thought <throat> I'd bring you along. Probably be a more interesting video if I went and checked ahead of time and then brought you along to oh, discover it, but... <clears throat> Not how it goes usually. Oh, that one looks like it might have some way up there in the crotch. Maybe it's just fungus. Black lump up there though. Anyways. That's a beauty, huh? I do see some fungus, but not the kind I'm looking for. Well, it's got some nice old birch bark to offer us up. Dead one too. Probably shouldn't stand under it. I think that's a elephant's foot they call them. Fungi. Fungus among us. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, There's some more fungus. I don't don't know my funguses really well. But there's some deer poops. Look at them all, and I'll be damned, it looks like the deer is coming over here to eat that. See it? Funny, they only ate that one kind, so that's probably the one for humans could eat, because I noticed there's more than one kind, or actually it appears that it's old ones that have rotted. So, I'm sure I got some friends that can tell me what them are. I'm going to try to look them up. I might even bring one home. My hands are getting full and I'm running out of pocket, so 
I better just keep looking for the chaga. I might take one with me just to check it out. I don't know. Definitely not going to eat it without identifying it. Nor should you guys, anybody. Got to know your mushrooms. Alrighty. I'm going back to looking around. I see some more birches out through there too. And then I'll cut back down towards the house. You see the fields way out there probably. Way down there is where the house is. Alright, let's get back to you. Right there looks like a chunk of it, but a little too high for me to reach. But I am glad I came back over because I just found something cool. Ah, it looks like some moss. It feels so dry and fluffy. I'm going to look around a bit. Put it in my pocket with fat wood and it'll hopefully make some nice tinder to get a spark lighter. Alrighty, I gotta go. See ya. <clears throat> Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. Everywhere. Alrighty, I'm gonna keep moving. Not having much luck, so I'm just gonna buzz right along. Well, as fast as I can buzz. Alright, we'll get back to you. See ya.